I really cannot wait to see how this sunscreen looks like on dark skin. Wait. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Tamno. Today I'm going to be reviewing another sunscreen for you guys and this one is by Sunday Riley. If this is something you're interested in, then keep on watching. So this is what the pack of the sunscreen looks like. I really do like the packaging. It's so cute. And I like how small it is. Very travel friendly. I want to take out the seal it has. I'm super excited. This is like the most expensive sunscreen I've used yet. <laughs> oh, the color is so pretty. It's pink. Okay, I saw this. I saw this already, but me opening it up and seeing it myself is really cute. Ryan Little. <laughs> Yoga. Okay, guys, you guys have seen the hand swatch. Here, I apply the sunscreen, and here, I have nothing. There's a slight difference. Yep, there's a slight difference. Let me know if you guys see it in the comment section. So we can see that that blended in well, but then that's hand swatch. Let's apply it on my face and see if it will be the same or there will be a change. So because this contains zinc oxide, I'm going to do it one at a time and I'm going to be warming it up in my palm. First application. Second one. Warm it up. Now the third one. I just finished applying this sunscreen and this is what I look like. So I'm setting my timer for 15 minutes to see if there'll be any difference. So while that is counting down, I'm going to talk about the sunscreen. The reason why I was so excited to try out this sunscreen is because I haven't seen any dark skin review this sunscreen on YouTube. So I'm going to start first with the texture and the finish. This sunscreen has a not too thick, not too runny consistency. It is pink in color. In terms of finish, this leaves you with a dewy finish. It is kind of, you know, there's a shine to it. Definitely, you can see it. Despite the light, you can see all the glue I have. Let me come up. So here I apply the sunscreen from my whole face down to this area but this area where I don't have sunscreen has no shine so definitely this sunscreen gives you a shine. Two, what are the sunscreen claims and what type of sunscreen is this? So this sunscreen claims to be a breathable, lightweight and transparent sunscreen that sinks into the skin without leaving you with a white chalky residue or an oily finish it is both a physical and a chemical sunscreen this is a 99 percent oil free formulation and it's perfect for all skin types and all skin tones mm. <laughs> really <laughs> really 
This product is available to ship only within the US. It is quality free, sulfate free, paraben free, gluten free, soy free, fragrance free. It is vegan. I thought I should mention that. Who is this sunscreen best recommended for? It is best recommended for all skin types and all skin tones. I have a combination to oily skin just in case you're wondering. The next thing is the price and the quantity. So this sunscreen retails for $35 and you do get a 40 ml tube. It's the most pricey sunscreen I have reviewed on this channel. Well, I didn't buy this particular sunscreen. It was sent to me if I didn't mention. It's a gifted product to share my honest opinion, which I'm doing right now. So what type of sunscreen is this? This is a hybrid sunscreen. It contains both chemical and mineral sunscreen filters. According to the ingredients, the active ingredients or the sunscreen filters are octisalate at 5%, Octocrylene at 3.5% and zinc oxide at 16.32%. From the packaging, I just noticed that this is not waterproof. It says here when using this product, keep out of eyes, rinse out with water to remove. So don't wear this during the wet season if you are. So it's been 15 good minutes since I applied the sunscreen and this is what I have. I think it did reduce. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. So back to the ingredients. So this can be rinsed out with water. You don't have to use um, any other thing but i always like to double cl um, cleanse whenever i wear whatever sunscreen okay um why i did 15 minutes um time hours because you're always advised to apply sunscreen 15 minutes before sun exposure and i wanted you guys to see if this actually changes in terms of the cast so other ingredients include turmeric root extract soft seed flower oil this product also contains alcohol decant i thought to mention so if you're someone who doesn't like alcohol decant in your product you should stay away from this one so does this sunscreen have a scent yes it does have a scent and this is because of the turmeric you, i can really pick the turmeric from sniffing but it's not overpowering whatsoever it does fade off after application so here are my final thoughts i like the color i like the packaging i like the consistency i don't like the price it's pricey i have to be honest i think for their first sunscreen they did a good job the only thing that um i like to say about the sunscreen that it's not necessarily for all skin tones like on my own skin there's a cast like i have to wait 15 minutes for it to go in and there is still a tiny bit of cast so if you're darker than my skin this is going to leak you with much more cast expect that but if you're lighter you can see the area where I applied it on my neck, because my light, my neck is lighter than my face, has no single cast at all. Um, but my face, there's a tad bit of cast, tiny bit. I kind of like hybrid sunscreens too. They are also great on that foundation, so I'm gonna keep wearing it. Will I repurchase this sunscreen? I won't repurchase this sunscreen, you know, honestly, because I can get other sunscreens that are cheaper that would do the job as opposed to me restocking a 35 dollars sunscreen so guys we have come to the end of this video i hope you guys found my video helpful if you did find it helpful please give it a thumbs up like it share it subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next one also let me know in the comment section if you've purchased this sunscreen or intend buying it and what your general thoughts on this sunscreen is until next time bye